Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a Fashion Nova jean haul. Thank you so much to Fashion Nova for supplying the jeans for this haul. All thoughts and opinions, of course, are my own. This is going to be a little bit of a roller coaster. Uh, I think for most women, not even just most plus size women, jeans are a struggle. A struggle. Um, and I've spoken a lot in the past about how much I love Fashion Nova jeans. This was kind of a, a rocky haul. Um, if you're not interested in my ramble, go ahead and skip to the try on portion of this haul, which I will put on the time on the screen. Um, but I am going to ramble just a little bit before we get into it. Just a little bit of kind of a disclaimer. First, um, I feel like Fashion Nova is very much known for fitting an hourglass body. If you look at their models, almost all of them are just like that perfect hourglass shape. So an issue in the past with their, with their jeans normally was like the waistband wouldn't really fit me. I did one of these videos about a year ago. I think it was last fall. And I was absolutely in love. Everything fit very consistent, very true to size. Um, I do feel like they've gone a little bit back towards the catering to an hourglass shape. Most of these jeans, not all of them, there were I think three or four that I really, really liked. So there are some absolute winners in here. But I did feel like a lot of the waistbands were a little bit more snug, where the rest of the jean would be stretchy, but the waistband just doesn't really fit my midsection. I am kind of shaped like a cylinder or a rectangle. I do not have, hi, I guess we're snuggling. Anyway, I don't have an hour less shape. Typically jeans where the waistband has less stretch are not a good thing for me. It's a lot of the jeans that are, not all of them, but there are some of the jeans from my last haul. I'll link it down below that are still available. And I will talk about some of my favorites at the end of this video that have been very consistent throughout the year that I've gotten different washes in. And I, I just, that'll go back to TMI maybe, but I'm, I assume we're mostly women here. Now, Flo came to town yesterday, so I was definitely bloated. Um, had I not needed to get this haul filmed for you guys, I would have never tried on jeans yesterday. So that's another thing. I have endometriosis, so I do get quite bloated in my belly. But I do have to say some of these fit so consistently with the last jean haul that I think it's the newer denim that just isn't that you're gonna have to size up on if you're shaped like me. Does that make sense? I just wanted to put that out there because they might fit better in a week or so <laughs> when I'm less bloated, but I'll try and update you guys. But honestly, half of these just weren't my jam. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling. Let's go ahead and jump into this haul. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Do lots of plus size fashion, lots of beauty, stuff like that, makeup, vlogs, all of stuff and all of things. If you're into it, stick around. Let's be friends. Let's jump in. Okay, so all of these jeans are either in a size 20 or 22, usually, um, for the most part, until recently, I was really wearing like a size 20 at Fashion Nova, but I've noticed a lot of their jeans don't have as much stretch as they used to, so I think, honestly, from now on, I'm just gonna have to stick to a 22 just to be safe. I do have arthritis, so I do swell in my knees. I have endometriosis, so sometimes my belly swells. Jeans are very difficult for me, so I'm not gonna lie, I am a little bit bummed that some of these just, there's no way, like I just won't be comfortable in them. But there are some definite winners, so we will go through. I'm just going to go through kind of randomly. I'm not gonna really put them in an order uh, because everyone's looking for something different and what someone finds good or what's gonna fit their body when it comes to jeans is you know gonna be different. If you are shaped like me, I definitely have a few absolute winners for you that you're gonna love. And again, I will also give you guys the price of the jeans on the screen and tell you what current price they're at right now. Do keep in mind that Fashion Nova often runs 40% off sales, stuff like that. So it's never gonna really be that true price. It's usually gonna be able to get them for like, you know, like you're always gonna be able to save. All right, so a lot of these are skinny jeans because that's what I personally prefer, but I also did a pair of flare jeans, a boyfriend cut jean and a straight leg jean. We're actually gonna start with the straight leg jean because that's the first one I tried on. These ones, they are called the Penthouse Premium Straight Leg Jeans Medium Blue Wash. They come in three different washes. These did not have as much stretch as what I'm used to. Uh, so this being the first one I tried on, I was like, oh, huh. there's still stretch, there is. But these definitely are snugger in the waistband. They're sold by Fashion Nova, but they are, I guess, Wax House brand? Wax Jean Collection. I don't know if that's like by Fashion Nova or what. These ones I got in a size 20. I did check all of the reviews and most of the reviews were good. So I went, if it said that they ran small, I went to a 22. I did not love these. These are straight leg jean. First of all, it's not really my jam. And second of all, the waistband, again, there was more stretch in the rest of the pants than there was in the waistband. Um, if you, I would just say, if you are like me, especially if you have 
the issues that I do where sometimes your belly kind of swells, <laughs> where you're sometimes more bloated, then I would just maybe go up a size. They're nice jeans. They're nice quality. These guys retail, I think, for $29.99. $29.99. This pair of jeans, if you do like it, it does come in three different washes. Um, it's also high rise. It's an ankle straight, raw cut hem. This authentic denim with stretch. So it's not like a super stretch jean. It's just got a little bit of stretch. Yeah. So these ones just, I won't spend too much time talking about it. They just weren't, they just weren't my jam. And I have all the love in the world for Fashion Nova. I just, I am, a, I just, mm, jeans have never been my thing. Thick calves, thick thighs, got a belly. Jeans are difficult to fit. And if there's not enough stretch, like my calves will just not, not accept them, you know? All right, so the next ones we're going to talk about are the It Curvy Distress Skinny Jeans. These retail for $29.99. Again, Fashion Nova has sales, but I'm just going to give you the base price. These I got in a size 20, and I actually really like these. They are, there's extra room around the booty area. These are the only ones that like had a ton of extra room where I felt like they were so stretchy, so comfortable. They're absolutely adorable. This is definitely my type of jean. You guys know I live for a black pair of distressed skinny jeans and I love these. They're comfy. They're just, they're so good. I wish that they came in other colors as well because I would order more. I wish there were just a little bit higher of a rise. It says they're available in a white wash as well. I didn't see those. They have real pockets, which is nice. It's always nice when you find one that's like super stretchy. Again, see these ones have extra stretch in them, but they still have pockets. Love these. I feel like these have been around for a while. I feel like I've seen them for a while. Let me check how many pages they have reviews that was another thing I feel like the ones that have been around for a while you can check if they've been around for a while depending upon how far back the reviews go if they go to early 2020 then you're usually pretty good they should be not always but you sh should be a little bit better size I feel like they were just more generous with their sizing before in this one I mean they're consistent enough that I did get nine out of ten pairs on my body but I'm all about comfort I need a comfy jean that's just me. Um, but I do think that this pair right here is definitely one of them. I apologize if I feel a little spacey. I will have said this in Monday's video to my last clothing haul. We have uh, smoke in the area from the Oregon and like the Pacific Northwest fires that are going on. Fires in California, all of the smoke has made it to my area of Eastern Washington and our air quality is actually past hazardous. So I am a little, it makes me super lightheaded. It always has. It happens almost every year. And so I'm extra spacey. I don't want to seem negative in this haul. I'm not trying to be negative. I just want to be honest with you guys. And if I'm a little bummed about something, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to be super real with you guys. You know that Fashion Nova, I am on the cusp of their plus size. I am right at the edge of where they cut off. They do go up to a size 22. And I think that, again, I'm just going to have to go to a size 22. So let me just grab another pair. These guys also had a tighter waistband. This is the newer pair of jeans for them. I really do think it's something going on with the new jeans that they've put out. They're just not as generous as they were last year. The whole push of jeans last fall was so good. I got them buttoned, but they were snug. The waistband was snug. The rest of the jean actually had a lot of stretch. The reviews on this one were absolutely great. I don't know if people are just used to the fitting or if I just, I don't know. I don't know. So the bottoms of these are super distressed. These guys, the picture is really cute. It does like the, the waist is a little bit cinched on her and she's got a perfect figure. She is one of the curved models that you see a lot on the website and her body is banging good for her. Um, so again, these are Catch Your Vibe Skinny Jeans Light Blue Wash. They are $42.99, so this is one of the more expensive pairs. These do go up to size 22. If I were to order them again or had I purchased them myself, I would definitely be sending them back to get a size 22. Um, I would size up on them. I do, of course, like a looser fit. These do have front pockets. Most of these pants that I got this time actually do have front pockets. I went through and read so many reviews. I really thought I was going to have like 10 pairs of killer jeans for you. Um, so we're a little bummed. Okay, look at, this is the leg. That's a decent amount of stretch, right? Like super stretchy. Then you get to the waistband and it just, it's like half the stretch. So that's, that's just the biggest problem for me with my body shape is that's like the big, oh, that's my belly, you know, my belly. So these were not a win for me. All right, so the next ones we're going to talk about are the Aubrey High Rise Distress Jeans. I got them in the dark denim wash. They are $37.99 is their base price. These ones are interesting because they go, they have number sizes and 1X, 2X, 3X in these. I'm not sure how those will differ. I know that they technically consider their 3X tops a size 20, but when it comes to bottoms, I do find the 3X to be kind of inconsistent, again, because sometimes their waistbands are just smaller because 
the hourglass shape that I do not have. Um, but they do go to a size 22. So if you like them, I would just go up a size. I normally feel like when they don't have real front pockets, they're stretchier. The actual denim part is stretchy. Just like, what is with the waistband? I'm sorry. I'm not trying to be like a snot. I just, like it has some stretch, but it's like a, a low stretch, a mid stretch. And just extra chunky. I don't know. All right, so this next pair of jeans, you guys have heard me talk about their classic high-waist skinny jeans a lot. I definitely recommend the classic high-waist skinny jean and the super high-waist skinny jean. So this one is the only 3X in the haul. All the other ones are gonna be a size 20 or a size 22. These are like the jeans that pretty much made Fashion Nova famous. They were on Kylie Jenner. The picture is actually of Kylie when you search the website. These jeans come in five different washes. They come, they go up to a size 15 or 1X, 2X, 3X. I have a size 3X. I hauled these. They were one of the first pairs of jeans from Fashion Nova that I was like, oh girl, these are good. I love these. I do have to say these feel like a thinner fabric than my other pair of these. I got another one because I love those so much. I was like, maybe I'll just get another, I'll just get another. I wanted to be able to bring you guys a really solid pair of jeans. Like they just kind of smooth everything out. Every time I wear them, people are like, oh girl, you lose weight. No, I'm just wearing really amazing high-waisted jeans. These guys are $34.99. Again, wait for a sale, but I definitely recommend these. They are a snug fit, but they have stretch so they don't feel uncomfortable, even if they kind of look snug. I don't know. I really like these. We're going to talk about some flare jeans, you guys. Some flare jeans. These are the Here to Stay flare jeans. They come in four different washes. I have not worn a flare jean since I was probably in high school, I would guess. Um, it's not really my personal type of jean, but so many of you guys have asked for different types of jeans. Plus, I wanted to give you a more like comprehensive video. Fashion Nova does carry mostly skinnies, but they definitely have so many different kinds. They have mom jeans, boyfriend jeans, straight leg jeans, flare jeans, bootcut jeans, they they got it if you if you if you want it they probably got it they have so many jeans they are known for their jeans so these guys all of the reviews said oh my gosh these run so small they run small they run small uh so i went with the 22 i honestly feel like the waistband on this is so tiny it is definitely designed for a hourglass shape <laughs> definitely so even sizing up they were still tight i did get them buttoned and zipped but it wasn't comfortable. It wasn't a great experience. I did not love these. They're really long. Even on me, they were like bunching up around my feet. I know that's kind of the style. So if you want to wear them with heels, they'll be beautiful with some boots or something like that. Like they would be great. They on the right person if they're your jam. They're a gorgeous pair of jeans. They just, I don't love how they look on me personally. And they just didn't fit great for me. The front pockets are faux pockets. They don't have real pockets. There is some distressing on the knee. It's a 34 inch inseam. All of these jeans, if you go to the website, if you click on them, it'll give you much more detail on each pair of jeans. I don't know. I was really excited to try these. I was kind of hoping they would work for something different for me, um, but shoot, they just weren't the best for me. All right, so these next ones we're gonna talk about are a pair of boyfriend jeans. They are the Keep Coming Back boyfriend jeans. I got these in a light blue wash just to have something a little bit different. These in the reviews, it did say that they ran small, so I went with the size 22, which I think was a great option because there is a little bit of extra room in the size 22. They are so comfy. They're super comfy. They don't have a ton of stretch. There is stretch in there, but they're not the stretchiest pair of jeans, but because of the fit, they're a little bit looser. I really like these. I'm honestly shook that I like them because this normally is not my thing. I normally, I love a skinny jean, you guys. I love a skinny jean, but I really like these. They have the rolled cuff. They did, uh, they were short on me with the rolled cuff, but I think they were supposed to be kind of like ankle jeans. Again, taller though, so that would definitely depend upon your height. When I unrolled them, they were pretty much a perfect length. It says moderate stretch, so I feel like that is a good description of them. A little stretchy, not super stretchy. Flamer plus only runs small. Sometimes they will put in the description if they run small. I really like them. If you're looking for something that is not a skinny jean and you want something that is more of like a boyfriend jean, a mom jean, these ones are great. I definitely recommend these ones. It's the Always Bossy 2 skinny jeans. These are medium denim. These are only $19.99. Crazy. This is one of the most affordable pairs in this haul. And these had the same issue, <laughs> the same issue where they just were a little snug. I could get in them, uh, but they were just a little tight. They honestly didn't feel like cheaper jeans at all. They felt like just as good of quality as the other one. You can see the leg had a decent amount of stretch in them. 
So but these I got in a size 20 because I didn't see anything saying that they didn't really fit great. Um, these have a little more stretch. They just were a little bit snug. I feel like these ones, um, when I'm less bloated, I'm actually going to like them more. I feel like these might still be a winner. They were just a little snug and I was already, <laughs> I feel bad that I, I filmed it on a day where I was just like not feeling the jeans, but no girl wants to try on jeans when she feels bloaty. I would definitely love them in a size 22. I think that if I were to get them again, I would probably just size up. I just wish these were a little, a little bit bigger, but they were on the better side. They were one of the better ones that were still snug, uh, but I think that I will get some wear out of. They're cute. They're cute. Let's we'll see what some stats, and especially for the price, these are a really good one. So if you want um, to feel like snatched in your pants, just get your true size. But if you want a little bit extra room, I would just go up a size. Uh, these ones are also a mid-rise. That may have been part of it too. I do feel like when I get a, a pair of mid-rise jeans from them, they don't really fit me as great because they don't, the belly, you know, I have a roll. Like that's how I'm shaped. It just is what it is. So a mid-rise kind of hits me on my widest point. So that makes perfect sense why this one still being stretchy, like wasn't perfect for me. That makes sense. Sorry. I did this all last night and I'm a little bit spacey from all the smoke in the air. Uh, but I do think that's probably the biggest problem. That's probably why they didn't quite work. I need a high rise. I need a high rise because we got that roll. I'm going to save the very best ones for last just because I'm being a turdlet. Uh, but this was the one pair that I just did not get up because they have zero stretch in them. They didn't go over my calves. Oh, they are rigid denim. Girl, these rigid. Um, so I won't spend too much time talking about these. These are $34.99. If you like a jean that has absolutely zero stretch, you might like these. If you have smaller legs, um, then you'll probably like them. I just have way too thick of calves. Like it just, it was not working. Plus I just don't find non-stretch jeans comfortable personally. Again, with all of the swelling in my joints and endometriosis and all of the things that I have going on. I just, I need extra stretch. I need extra room. So they're high rise, five pockets, rigid denim, distressed detail front, button zipper closure, relaxed skinny fit. Any jeans from anywhere don't work for me when there's no stretch. I guess I should have realized what rigid denim meant. I was not thinking, but like looking at these for a size 20, like that's a, that's a decent, I was like, that's gonna fit my butt. And then I was like, no, she's not. None, nothing. All right, last pair. We are on to the last pair. And I did kind of strategically save this one for last because I want to end it on a positive note because I do, when I find a good pair of Fashion Nova jeans, I really do love them. So they are the Slow and Steady High Rise Jeans in Washed Black. They are $32.99. They are high rise. They have five buttons in the front. So they are button closure. They have five pockets. They have real pockets. They have a frayed hem. They are a little bit on the shorter side. So if you are a tall bean like me, they're going to be a little bit more of an ankle jean. But I have to tell you, these when I put these on, these felt exactly like the jeans did last year. They were, they not only fit, but they had like a little extra room. They were comfortable. They weren't just like just fit where I feel like a lot of their size twenties now just fit me. Um, this one actually had a little extra room. I went and looked to see, like, I was trying to figure out if I could figure out when they were released. And like I said earlier, if you go and you look at the reviews, you can see when the reviews start. And these reviews started, I didn't go all the way back, but I got to very early 2020 with extra pages. So I assume these are from 2019. So I do think, I just think that their jeans have gotten a little bit smaller um, because these ones are so comfortable with so much extra room. I mean, things happen, things change, designers change, maybe different people are making their jeans. I don't know. I don't know their business. These are awesome. If you're looking for an alternative to a black distressed jean or just an alternative to black denim, they're that really, it's, it's a really nice dark gray um the black wash i just really like these i feel like they're gonna be really cute i love when high-waisted jeans have cute buttons i just feel like they're cuter they're like i love any high-waisted jeans let's get real but when they have cute buttons it makes it it just adds a little something extra to the outfit so these are a winner love 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 these obviously everything's linked down below for you guys they're not affiliate links at all there is a click counter link at the top so if you shop through that link they just know that i sent you but i love these fashion nova please make more jeans like this one. Not that I have any influence on anything ever, but I, they're just so, they're so good. So comfy, just like the right amount. They could be actually a little bit stretchier, but because there's extra room, they work. They work. Um, I think those were probably my favorite pair that I put on out of the entire haul. All right, loves. So 
that is all 10 pairs of jeans. I hope you found something that you will like. I hope that there's someone out there watching this that does have more of an hourglass shape, but is really going to benefit from this haul. Of course, no matter what shape you are, I hope that you somewhat benefited from this haul and I hope that I have some good ones for you. I will continue to try out Fashion Nova's denim and I will be trying, I think, more 22s just to see uh, besides the ones that I know are winners. I will leave links to some of the, my favorite ones that I've had that seem really consistent that I've had for a while down below. But a couple off the top of my head are, of course, the classic high-waist skinny. The super high-waist skinny are so stretchy. If you want some that are like wearing leggings, super high waist ones are amazing. The classic ones are a little bit thicker. Um, they're a little bit more like jeans, but they're still jeggings. But then the super high waisted ones are like leggings. They're so thin, so comfortable. I also really love the flex game strong ones. Oh, I'm trying to remember. My last Fashion Nova haul had a couple of really solid pairs that fit decently. Uh, so I might include those in the list down below. I, I'm sorry that this wasn't the most positive haul, but I want to be honest with you guys. And nothing sucks more than when you put on a pair of jeans and they just don't make you feel good about yourself and again some of the factors could have played in but I have had this issue in other hauls with the newer denim from Fashion Nova so definitely do your research read all the reviews you know it is what it is I mean a tour sometimes I wear a 20 sometimes I wear a 22 it really just depends so I guess Fashion Nova um it just depends but I always would rather have more room so I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna go with the size 22 not all the time but sometimes from now on just to be cover my bases so I can find some good pairs of jeans uh but the last two in my last haul were amazing I tried so hard to make this a positive haul um with all of the research I did on each pair and give you guys a variety I hope you enjoyed the variety but sometimes it just happens sometimes it's just you know it is what it is jeans are hard we all I assume every woman has had days like jeans are like the last thing I want to try on um, even though I love jeans and when I have a good pair of jeans but yeah I'm gonna stop rambling again I hope this was helpful and much love to Fashion Nova thank you for the jeans um, I'm sorry that uh, this wasn't the most positive haul in the world but I gotta I gotta keep it real and they do have some when you have a good pair from them they are a great pair they are an amazing pair and I still think that Fashion Nova jeans, their good pairs, fit me better than any jeans from anywhere. So please keep that in mind. Don't be scared of Fashion Nova jeans <laughs> from this haul from having a few that just didn't really work for me. And again, I, I need a certain pair of jeans. You might need a completely different pair of jeans. It all is personal preference and your body and what feels good to you and wear what makes you feel good and I'm gonna wear what makes me feel good. And I'm really psyched about the few pairs in this haul that I really do love. Okay, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I will talk to you soon. Bye. Mom, you're looking for a super comfy, stretchy, distressed, distressed, <laughs> distressed denim. This is it. What are you? What are you? I'm sure there's plenty of people that are gonna be like, no, you just gain weight, so you need to size up. Okay. Stressing. But that's a problem. Problem? I'm just creating words over here.